When I was a little guy, I want when I grew up, I wanted to be a farmer just like Dad. I'm a third generation farmer. My grandfather moved to the current location in 1943 when my father was five years old. He took over after Grandpa retired, and now I have taken over. We have uh, 175 commercial Red Angus Simmental Cross beef cows. I utilize AI in the heifer project and the cows. Farm about 2,000 acres, 500 acres of which is alfalfa that is targeted towards the dairy market and then my own use. And then we raise wheat, corn, soybeans. Um, prior to having our last little boy here, um, I worked for the Soil Conservation District. Right now I'm basically in charge of the household and with three little boys that's a full-time job all in itself. Um, I also do I guess I'm the messenger woman, take all the messages as far as um, interest in hay, things like that. It's been interesting just learning to work together when you're used to working separately and then being a joint. It's been an, a learning experience for both of us. I think one of our biggest challenges has been availability of land and profitability of land prices, rental, things like that. A uh, hay customer of mine tell me that his son is taking over now and he's in his 50s that his grandfather started farming with raised a family on two quarters of land and his dad raised a family on four quarters of land. This particular dairyman raised his family on eight and so he's just kind of wondering what the future holds because he says he doesn't think that it will be an option for his son to have 16. So just getting bigger or having more of a land base probably isn't going to be the option in the future as it has been in the past generation. And Mother Nature, she gives and she takes away. We've had too much rain, too little rain, hail. You know, rain at the wrong time so you know there have been some challenges we've we've rode them through but every day I get up and I enjoy what I do and I want to provide for my family and raise them in the environment which I grew up which I value highly and I guess that's 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 what keeps me going or that one good crop always looking for that golden crop but at one point in time, Mark and I had talked about, you know, if farming wasn't a possibility, what would he do or you know, things like that if things didn't work out. And, but I know Mark wouldn't be happy doing anything else. Not much of a dreamer. I'm a facts man. Isn't that the truth? Show me the money. <laughs>